guys it's Maria with all things Maria um, this is video is gonna be um, about this makeup look honestly I just decided to do something like this on the makeup look and I'm very excited because I'm glad to be back so if you are new go ahead and hit that subscribe button down below and hit that notification button um, next to it so you get notified every time I post a new video um, so yeah, let's get to the video and how I did this look. And I hope you guys like it, so give me a thumbs up. Hey guys, so I'm actually going to be doing a voiceover for this video just because Ryan is sleeping and I didn't want to make too much noise while I'm um, doing this video, but I'm excited to be back and yeah. So the first thing that I'm doing is actually my eyebrows. So you guys know, if you guys have been a follower of mine, how I do my eyebrows. I haven't changed my routine, it's still the same, um, but my eyebrows are actually uneven or like, if that makes sense. Um, so one is higher than the other, so I just have to see and do what I can to make them as even as I can. Okay, so I'm actually prepping my eyelids with um, eyeshadow primer because I don't want my eyelids to stay like what is it tinted you know um after i put eyeshadow on the first eyeshadow i'm doing um this is, this is a pinterest style look um i've done this look before but i decided to do it again as my welcome back type of video you know um but it is a makeup eyeshadow that i used and i didn't like the brush so i ended up switching it to a different one that actually put on the eyeshadow better so I did do this video um, in fast forward um, so you guys can see it more in detail like faster versus like how it actually took because it did take like half an hour for me to do this look and I wanted you guys to see it um, while I explain it and now I am actually doing a uh, purple eyeshadow just at the end um, so I'm going to be blending this so at the end it looks kind of darker um, as you will see right now. This is a cut crease look. Um, I do kind of regret using the type of concealer I used for this look. Um, just because it was kind of thicker or, yeah, I guess thicker to glide on um, and fix it. Um, I do uh, see that um, as I was doing my makeup that it wasn't how I wanted it to look. But I didn't want to start over so I just decided to go with it, you know. Um, I know it's not perfect. Uh, mind you, I've taken like... A year and a half of break from doing makeup so it is kind of like a beginner thing again for me so don't judge me um, but yeah I, I understand and I see it <laughs> So here I'm adding like a peach color um, to my eyeshadow so you don't have to see the concealer and I am kind of correcting it as much as I can so it doesn't look as bad um, but I am adding the peach color um, and then I'm going to add like the glitter. I don't have like white glitter so I just used the eyeshadow um, that I had that I thought blended more in with um, the inspired look so yeah. Here, I'm just blending everything together, honestly, just so it's not, like, um, messed up as much. Um, I'm literally just blending everything, um, at the end, um, so it looks neater than it was right now.
Now I'm adding pink shadow um, under my eye just so it completes the look. I usually forget to do this when I'm doing my makeup lives, but then I realized that on my inspired look, that's what um, she had. So this is um, just adding it to make my eye stand out a little more. guys I'm really proud I actually did eyeliner and um, my eyelashes and it's been a minute but I never do eyeliner and today I decided to do the actual full-on look and I'm very proud because uh, since I have hooded eyes I usually don't do eyeliner just because of that but right now I'm actually covering up my scars or my pimples if you want to call them whatever um, just acne in general um, covering them up with concealer and then I'm adding foundation. I actually did a hack and I posted it on my TikTok. It is Maria G Official and then the number one. Um, if you guys want to go follow me on TikTok. And all I'm doing is just blending everything all together. And then I add concealer and then blend that in. And then now I'm using bronzer um, and just blending it in. Uh, I am just using the powdered bronzer right now. Um, I would do a, like, a look later on using how I actually uh, bronze my face like full on. Um, but right now I'm just using like just a powder bronzer. Um, not to do something too extra. And then I'm going to blush. Use blush. Um, and then I do see that I have like glue on my um, eyelash. That was by mistake just because when I put it on there I think there was already like glue left on that eyelash. Um, but now I'm using highlighter. I love using highlighter because I feel like bronzer, highlighter, blush, they make your, your face look more, like, nice, if that makes sense, you know? Um, they do finish the look. They give it good compliments to the rest of your makeup. So I'm actually using lip balm. It's the lavender lip balm from Friendly Beauty, my small business. If you guys haven't uh, seen or heard of it, I linked everything down below so you guys can go support my small business. Um, it's a, a friendly um, cosmetic uh, business. So if you guys are interested in doing like skincare or makeup, go check it out. Um, right now I'm actually using eye lip liner. <laughs> I'm actually using lip liner. Um, it's something that I actually added to all my makeup routine uh, because it actually makes my lips stand out and it also helps um, with any like lip gloss or lipstick that I wear. Um, it just gives it a better like compliment and it makes it stand out. So I actually used a um, matte lipstick for the like first time in months. I've been using my lip glosses. Um, they're usually like pigmented a little bit. Um, but I'm actually excited to be using a matte lipstick after a while. And it actually complements my uh, makeup look, you know. So this is the, the finished product and yeah I hope you guys liked it so if you did give me a thumbs up. This is the inspiration I use from Pinterest. Um, it's similar but not completely and the only thing that I didn't have was the white glittery thing. Um, I only had light pink and I think it still worked out. Um, and guys I don't do eyeliner and I did eyeliner. And it turned out pretty good. Um, so I hope you guys like this video. And I can't wait to show you guys some more. Um, thank you guys so much for subscribing. Bye.